Today we're going to be driving this ship full of passengers into the Bermuda Triangle. Let's get started. So I got probably 20 people stuffed in this thing. But let's go ahead and get this thing started. We got a whole bunch of controls here. We have used this boat before, so it's pretty fun stuff going on here. Let's turn on our two engines. This is a very simple boat to start up. Let's turn on some of our displays here because we need to see stuff. And then we actually got some two people in here helping us with our navigation and our engineering. So hold on, we're going to full throttle here. And the Bermuda Triangle in this game is supposedly 11 kilometers that way. So let's check it out on map here so yeah it's basically just this area right here there's not really anything over here so it's really scary a lot of bad stuff can supposedly happen but here we go i guess we're going over there today for some reason so once i get this thing angled over here i'll give you guys a bit of a tour of the ship and show you where all the passengers are at and sir if you see anything abnormal on sonar or radar please let me know because we already have some radar targets i wonder if there's like other boats out here yeah we're detecting a whole bunch of radar targets but if you see anything on this blue sonar right here that's going to be an issue you because that's normally like a kraken or something so definitely be prepared all right we got a straight route through the bermuda triangle over there so we do have a bridge we actually have to go under i don't know if this thing can fit but um navigator and these people will warn me obviously if anything of that happens so we're gonna go down here give a bit of a tour so we got a whole bunch of people up here so you need to be in your seat we are driving still so that's absolutely not safe but down here we have someone in the sona um and then over here we have uh some seating area and then oh of course debbie's the bartender oh my god of course she is of course she chose that job for herself anyways we got some stuff over here and then we got some more crew quarters over here so i hope you guys are enjoying your um boating experience so far we're gonna be driving in the bermuda triangle today yeah i probably should shouldn't have told them that but that's completely fine um debbie you want to start the ramen noodles for me you know the drill start making me some ramen noodles on the stove top here yeah i do remember what happened last time but that was completely your fault we actually need an engineer down here which one of you guys volunteer we're gonna bring this lady here that kind of looks like debbie for some reason she will be monitoring our engines so this lady is in charge of our engine so if anything happens to the engines it will be on her today Dude, but then out here we have the rear deck with some seating but then we actually have an emergency light bulb right here which we can auto extend like this probably shouldn't do that since it is not an emergency but then we have life rafts here just some bad stuff happens but yeah let's go ahead in the bridge here to make sure the radar and stuff is looking good okay we're, we're detecting one thing on radar that might be me or someone else i don't know what that is we're picking something up on radar hold on let's zoom in here can we zoom in any farther Let's see if it's like someone on the boat that's getting detected by this radar because that is a little abnormal. I don't know what that is, but yeah, we're just going to continue on our route here. And I'll see you guys when we're trying to make it under the bridge because I don't know if we can actually fit under there. All right, we're approaching the bridge right now. We have emergency power on, so like some more boost in the engine. So we go way faster with it on. It's normally at like 400 RPM and now it's at 900. So we're definitely going faster. We're detecting something on um, sonar over there. What is that? I don't know what it is. Do we see anything underwater? I don't know. There's something on. So oh, it might be that boat over over there okay that's goodness okay we got a bridge here we have to somehow go over i think right there is a good clear area right there because everywhere else just kind of looks really hard to get through but here we go we're gonna go through this oh my gosh there's actually two bridges here okay i thought it was just one but that there's two okay well we have to go through two bridges and then we have to go five kilometers to go to the center of the triangle i don't think we need to go all the way to the center we could just go like near it that'll definitely work it's like the same thing and we can see if we're gonna survive i don't think anything's gonna happen to us to be honest like i think everyone's just being overreactive to this it's just definitely not a real thing yeah in a bit here we actually might start entering the triangle i think it starts like right down here i think or maybe even lower i don't know the exact location but yeah, we're just entering the triangle right now. We're going to see what happens. All right, it is starting to get a bit deeper here. You can barely even see the bottom. I can see the shadow of our boat still on the bottom, but it's definitely going to get deeper the farther out we go into the triangle. So this is going to be really scary here. Our depth is lowering as we speak ever so slightly, but it is definitely going down. So cool stuff we got going on here. How's sonar looking? Anything abnormal on here? I don't think we're detecting anything. We got some radar targets, but nothing on sonar good news good news how's it going navigator but yeah let's check our weather radar right here okay everything is calm no right everything's looking perfect all right nice How's your guys' boating experience going oh the waves are picking what in the world okay hold on we need to go out here the weather radar did not say this a couple seconds ago hold on okay now it's like moderate wind so it's definitely starting to pick up already i don't know we need to turn on some lights here let's turn on all these lights outside of our decks just in case so everyone can see us these waves are absolutely massive we're getting airtime hold 
small, then we might need to throttle them. We're gonna turn off emergency power. I don't think that's necessary. Here we go. I think we're definitely in it right now. This is kind of spooky, honestly. It's super deep here. Oh my gosh, that was at 80 like a second ago. Holy, how deep are we? Okay, hold on. Let's see if we can see anything down below us. Ladies and gentlemen, we have entered the Bermuda Triangle. So if anything happens, that's definitely why. Um, We do have a ship over there we're detecting on radar. Um, How's he doing? Is he doing fine? Yeah, but there's a boat over there. I think they're fishing. So that's quite interesting. We're definitely in the triangle, though. These waves are getting kind of crazy. But yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this. We're, let's go downstairs here. Let's try out these ramen noodles. Hold on. It's getting really dark down here. Let's turn on some lights. All right. I'm going to try these ramen noodles Debbie just gave me. All right. Thank you for the ramen noodles, Debbie. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's really starting to pick up out there. Okay, we're just going to have some ramen noodles next to this kind lady. Honestly, those are some pretty good ramen noodles she made this time. Last time I had to throw her off the boat because she like really messed them up, but I think they're good this time. Thank you, Debbie. You're, do you're getting better, honestly. Every day you get better at making ramen noodles, but here we go. We're going to go to the top here. Excuse me, lady. Yeah, it's definitely um, light, violent rain and lightning. Okay, yeah, that's I can definitely feel that going on. Okay, we're in the center of the Bermuda Triangle. Let's go ahead and remove our waypoints. Our entire deck went under water right there so kind of some strange stuff uh we have some water in our engine room hold on we need to turn on activate bilge pumps there we go and then we're gonna turn it off because i don't know why but we had some water entering our engine room there it might be just from the rain going on these waves are really kicking up your way hold on a sec these waves are so big okay these are like the size of our boat waves so not cool stuff going on here the waves are going completely over our boat this is a little scary i'm not gonna lie oh my that's a huge one right there oh that's not good this is like a mini tsunami going over our boat here. Oh, it's going over. Oh, this is so much airtime. Here we go. We're going to crash down. Oh, oh my gosh. Our entire deck went underwater. That's absolutely crazy. Nothing to worry about here, passengers. We're just in some rough weather. Um, This supposedly happens like every night in the triangle, and that's where we're at. Oh, I was flying there. Oh my gosh. Okay, that window went underwater. Not This is a display of what's going on out there. I don't know if you guys want to look at that. It's a little scary. Oh, oh my, oh my gosh. Okay, yeah. Jeez, I've never seen anything like these waves before. Um, as long as we don't detect anything on sonar, I think we're good. Oh, we're crashing down. Oh my gosh, our bridge almost just went underwater there. Oh, we might have to emergency lock the boat here. Um, let's go out here, make sure no passengers are on deck. Okay, it's looking clear. Check our build pump level. Make sure everything's looking good. Okay engine room slash front bilge um what's going on in the engine room 200 water okay yep automatic bilge pumps on because there is water in the engine room oh so much air time these waves oh we're crashing down okay everyone get in your seats uh lady you need to get in a seat right now uh you need to stay in here oh my god what's going on out there hold on okay we got our um camera here so at least we can oh we're hitting the waves completely sideways okay yeah we cannot be doing that Okay, we're back up here in the bridge. Let's we need to hit these waves forward. So we're gonna angle it that way more because these waves are definitely pushing us. What in the world is that? Holy oh, oh, it just got struck by lightning too. Okay, we have a super big tsunami going towards us. I didn't know a tsunami would be in the Bermuda Triangle, but here we go, I guess. Dude, that's an absolutely crazy size tsunami. That's this thing's gonna completely destroy this thing. We're already about a capsize. Oh no. Hey, everyone remain seated. This is your captain speaking. We have a small wave heading towards towards us i'm um, not concerning at all just some stuff that happens every day if you guys know what i mean but here we go we're gonna hit this wave we're gonna full throttle here we need to hit this wave head on turn on emergency power we need to completely launch this thing here we go we're popping a wheelie here we go oh gosh our engine's roaring currently oh that's a huge oh we're gonna completely nosedive in the tsunami uh oh oh we are completely underwater we're on the tsunami right now we're trying to rise it oh that's not good that's not good oh we're capsizing oh no here we are we're at the top we're getting some major air time oh we're completely in the air oh don't cap capsize don't capsize oh no don't capsize oh my god our engines are going so loud okay turn the emergency engines off over dramatic uh, okay so we did capsize there that is not good at all we definitely did just capsize um our emergency lifeboat things did fall off those are like four thousand dollars a piece so we just that's really expensive hopefully we never need to use those anyway dude that was so crazy we got hit by a super large tsunami um we're gonna turn on our ox generator here just in case um we do lose power we want a generator around Running. make sure everything's looking good here on sonar and radar what's that blue dot we're detecting a blue dot on sonar
are currently directly in front of us i don't see anything in front of us currently or behind us i don't know it might be just an error um, i don't see anything on the sonar though but there is definitely a blue dot so that means something is lurking in the water beneath us currently that's a little spooky to think about it is a slightly concerning but these waves are getting worse and worse as we speak um it looks like it's kind of going towards us hold on let's zoom in a little more on it is currently moving if you guys see that oh my gosh these waves okay maybe we need to be hitting these waves head on and not completely sideways here now uh, we're going away from the waves now we're kind of like surfing them if you guys know oh that's definitely what we found oh did you guys see that oh my god Gosh, I think it was going for an attack there, but then it saw our propeller spinning and it was like, nope. Is that it? Is that the thing we're detecting on sonar currently? Um, we we've lost visual on sonar we're zooming in it's 500 meters behind us it's like right there it's really close behind us um where'd it go hold on it disappeared um where's it at is it like below us oh my gosh i don't know we've lost visual on it we're gonna zoom out here a little bit more maybe we can see it it might be swimming away it might be scared we never know um i don't know we're not detecting oh i see it on detecting it on sonar again it's really close it's within 250 meters of us so it's getting really close to our boat we've lost visual on it again i don't know where the this thing is at but there's stuff definitely not going good currently there's like smoke going on you guys see that hold on we need an emergency shut down these engines there's like i think they're smoking really bad oh oh my gosh the crack is attacking us okay um it broke some of our sonar stuff because it says oh my gosh we're so deep right now but this thing is currently attacking us what in the world is this thing doing hold on full throttle activate oh massive explosion on board massive explosion oh we're capsizing don't capsize this thing okay activate engines right now we're activating engines to run full throttle emergency mode okay here we go shred them in the engines let's go let's go oh we have a fire on board hold on we're gonna be activating fire suppression here fire suppression is on there we go please put out this fire okay, we're gonna be going downstairs in the basement here i think we have an engine fire oh there's water down here hold on lady i'm so sorry what you just witnessed uh, we just got attacked by some sea creature um just please remain calm we're having some engine issues down here oh there's water down here there's so much water fire suppression is disabled we have water oh my gosh okay we need to activate bilge pumps right now we have so much water in this boat hold on we need to go ahead go through this boat see what's going on here because i think we have a whole bunch of water coming okay close the engine room we need to seal the engine room from the outside okay is there any water down here i don't think there is okay we're gonna keep the engine room closed i don't know what's going on in there but no water in the laundry room let's go ahead and check the freezer nothing is in the free okay um never mind there's like water in the bottom of the freezer so that's interesting we're gonna go back up here in the bridge there's some emergency lights buzzing at us um does that mean something's going on Seventy thousand liters of water in the engine room currently okay that's definitely an issue i can just feel that we're listening right now maybe we should start getting lifeboats ready because this is not looking too good for us yeah i can definitely feel us starting to lower in the water okay maybe we should start lowering lifeboats. but dude an explosion went off and it actually like damaged the passengers really bad but let's see if there's any water down here maybe we should start loading lifeboats because this i think we're getting really low here yeah everyone stand up i think we need to start loading lifeboats this is not good uh the oh we're gonna get attacked again i see it's tattoo oh no uh uh oh hold on we got a front view of the camera here it's attacking us slowly okay get in the helm get in the helm we need a counter steer right now oh shoot we're getting attacked we're definitely getting attacked it's breaking our engines currently please keep the lifeboat on board we're gonna need that here in a second kraken oh please just let go do we have a gun or something hold on maybe this fire extinguisher will do the trick please get off of me okay oh oh gosh oh gosh oh gosh we're sinking we're sinking we're sinking what's going on i don't know what's going on right now it's bringing us to the bottom of the ocean i think we have a lot of water oh oh my gosh oh okay we're we're resurfacing but a ton of water just came in that's a little bit concerning we, we need to close that door right now what in the world why did so much water just come in okay i think it's beyond the point of lifeboats i think this is just really not good at all for us we're 100 sinking this thing's going down fast i mean that kraken really just messed up this thing oh it's still attacking us oh no okay we're gonna be activating emergency power currently emergency power is on we have emergency lights going off everyone remain seated stay inside we're just having some slight inconveniences here. Um, we have about 73,000 liters of water in the engine room and oh my gosh, there's water everywhere. Okay, what's going on down here? I see blood. Hold on, where did the rest of the people go? We definitely had more people over here. Um, oh my gosh, there's so much water in here. What in the world? Okay, you know what? I don't know what to do in this situation. I'm just going to lock myself on the bridge here because we're definitely going down. Oh, oh. 
Oh my gosh, how deep are we? Hold on. It's bringing us to the bottom of the ocean. Our depth is lowering as we speak. Oh no. Oh, we're so deep in the water right now. I don't even want to know. There's like blood going. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's blood rising. I think we have some dead passengers or something because there's a whole bunch of blood there. Um, We have a water leak. I can see it right there. We're resurfacing. Oh no, this is just no. Oh, where is this water coming from? We have the doors locked. Oh no, we're going to die in here. This is such a bad death. Are we rising? Okay, we are rising slowly. Holy, we are so deep. 350. That one's detecting. That might be incorrect. Um, that's really, really deep. I don't think this game can even get that deep. Okay, I don't know if we're going to the bottom of the ocean or if we're resurfacing because I can like kind of see the bottom there and the reflection of the shadow. I think we're going to the bottom of the ocean today, guys. This is not looking too good. There is like no air in here. We're going to drown slowly. Oh, no. We have alerts going off. Oh, no. We're sinking. This is not good, guys. We're slowly lowering to the bottom of the ocean. That's definitely it. We definitely just sank. And we got our last pocket of air here that's probably gonna be it this was an absolutely crazy sinking survival that ended so fast this triangle does not play around let me know if you'd like to see some more of these triangle videos make sure you guys like and subscribe hit that bell join the discord link is in the description thanks for watching and goodbye